Hi everybody, it's Lori Watzel here with the next installment of Tech Tip Tuesdays. And this week's tech tip is going to focus on an app called Book Creator. And Book Creator is a fabulous app that you as a teacher can create content for your students. That content, an ebook, will open up within the iBooks app and they can interact with the content in that way. On the flip side, students can create and share content using Book Creator, and it's a fabulous tool for that as well. Currently, Book Creator is on all 3rd through 8th grade student iPads. In addition to being on the 3rd through 8th grade student iPads, Book Creator is supposed to be on all teacher iPads as well and is technically available to you in the self-service app on your iPad. There's some issues right now with the current upgrade to iOS 7 and self-service, so at this moment you may encounter some difficulties if you try to install Book Creator from your iPad using self-service. So in the meantime, and for those high school teachers with students who don't have the app on their iPad at this point, there is another option. Book Creator for iPad is a $4.99 app. There is, however, now a Book Creator free, and it's exactly what it sounds like. It does exactly the same thing that Book Creator does, but you are limited to one book. It is possible to download the Book Creator free app and use the one book until the self-service situation is figured out and you as a teacher is able to download it or until that purchase is made for the high school students if that is something the high school staff feels might be beneficial. I'm going to go ahead and open up the Book Creator app and the first thing you see is a short tutorial. Rather than going through step by step what the app does, I'm not going to recreate the wheel. Red Jumper Studio, who is the maker of this app, has a fabulous little tutorial that you're going to see right now. What you see here is an example of a page that you or a student could create in a book using Book Creator. And just like you saw in the video, you have the option to add photos, you have the option to add videos, you have the option to add text, and though the video didn't show it, you also have the option to add sound. And uh, one of the areas that it kind of struck me as really fitting in well is a foreign language class, for instance, to see how fluent students are with certain vocabulary words. When you have completed a book and you go to the My Books area, and as you can see, mine is very unfinished, you have the option to export it as an EPUB document. And when you export as an EPUB document, this preserves all the video and the sound features and it will open up and on a student's iPad using iBooks. You also have the option to export it as a PDF. You'll of course lose some of the interactivity, but all of the content will be there. 
Last but not least, I want to point you to this website right here, support.redjumper.net forward slash forums. And this is the book creator support site. And it's got great how-to instructions and documentation for working with book creator. And some of the things you want to be aware of, for instance, you can add hyperlinks to add further interactivity to your books. And you also have the ability to combine books. So think about a bunch of students working on separate books on separate iPads and combining all of these books into one book. It's a possibility and it's an exciting one. If you have any questions, you know where to find me. And if your students create any great books using Book Creator or you create anything fabulous using Book Creator, please share. I'd love to see it. Have a great day.